I keep closing my mouth, but the blasphemy keeps coming out. No doubt I was born to shout about the truth. It is astonishing to hear that the truth is a blaspheme. But if that were true, I will continue a devotional emphasis to blaspheme. Because I am gripped by the might of stubborn determination to blaspheme. But if I fail in succeeding, it is because I succeeded in failing to tell you a blaspheme. But I am grateful to God that I just succeeded in telling you another blaspheme. The canal men call it a lie, but the religious folks brands it as a blaspheme. Let them know that you are getting along very well with my blaspheme. Therefore, a setback for me would be a setup for my comeback. Ha! Is this a blaspheme? <laughs> the brunette always received the attention of men. Whereas the Abino pathetically faces the rejection of men. This is what is killing their appetite as human beings. Stop this indecent act of massive segregation. Let's wake up from this deep intoxication of our drunkenness in placing limitation on the lives of the Abinos like Wayek, streamalized candidates writing their examination. And as a result, Many who could pass, fail and later join remedial organizations. But if many deserve to pass, why not allow its continuation? But no, 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 no. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. The interests of such people must be well protected so that Wayek can raise more revenue for himself. So that the pocket of teachers and remedial institutions will top up. Eventually, this truth of mine would turn up to be a blaspheme. Oh, Ghana, through all Amali.